Did you lay this giant rock? What the heckums? Good morning, everybody. Sad news, we lost another ram lamb, but it's warming up. And since I did that fencing, you can see I'm still congested. Uh, I have a little bit of energy. So what I told my wife I'll do is I'm gonna close this gate up. And then there was two other patches that I did, like four foot patches and I'm gonna turn them loose. I'm gonna put them out in the pasture right now. Everybody is doing fine today. Yesterday morning, I came out here and um, the smaller baby rams was frozen. I talked to one of the guys at the Ace, Ace Hardware over here. And he said it's sometimes, I don't know if it's true, but when it's uh, really cold like this and then they're, or the babies are milking, that they can actually, that, that colostrum or whatever, can freeze inside of them. Let's open this up. Um, yeah, this is where we need to untie it. I'll put you down right here. I didn't tie this. My dad tied this when I was in Florida and all the sheep got out, or a couple of them did. True tale of a good fisherman is if you could undo knots without cutting it. <laughs> Every time I go fishing with people, they'd be giving me their problems and I'd be untangling it. Lord bless my sheep in Jesus name. Give them strength and protection. Sooner or later, I'm gonna have to get rid of some of these predators that are out here. I have night vision and I haven't seen foxes and coyotes. And a livestock guarding dog would be great but until then, I'm gonna have to guard my own livestock. Um, here we go. Ugh. Everybody. I hope everything's closed. Cause this would be freaking dumb. Sweet. Go to pasture. There you guys go. Oh, that's so cool. Oh, Daisy. Did you find the uh, alfalfa pellets? You sneaky girl. I was honestly looking for these pellets and uh, Daisy found them. But the, the sheep are running around. Praise God, I'm gonna put this little tree tree feeder back right here and let's put some feed in there that's not for you but look at that they're already in the pasture that's not your mom though you might get headbutted i think that's that's the mom to that one i'm not sure who knows next i have to bust up the water both of these and fill them back up with liquid water because solid water doesn't go down the hatch that easily. Let's bust up this. Oh, I got shatter in my eye. I'm gonna flip it over. Ooh. <laughs> That's interesting. I wonder if Donda's in labor. Ah, they were just hiding over here. Getting acquainted. Donda, Drake, and Kanye, everybody's here and healthy. I need to move all the females, even uh, Dina, maybe Dina, because we might get a buck or move uh, Daisy and Dina, like she's in heat or something. Look how fluffy they are with their coat. And um, see if I can't put those goats in with my neighbor's goats without them noticing, because they have boar goats. I'll just sneak them in there at night take them back in like a month bada bing bada boom 150 days later i'm gonna have some some uh you better not mess with me dude freaking turkey scare me i don't know why daisy 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 come here daisy daisy Hey Daisy. Hey Daisy. 
Let's see if the water is gone. Yeah, it's still frozen solid. I guess I'll just leave it. And then when I see this thing overflowing from the house, then I know that it's thawed, but they need water. So I'll just let it thaw in the sun. Um, so many eggs. Well, that's a big headache relieved. Um, they can enjoy some sunlight, some grass. They could come back into the barn leisurely and on their own timing. Um, and then what I could do is lock up the other two females in one of those sections inside that barn. Um, and it's not supposed to be getting that cold again for a long time. I hope at least. This is my girl. Uh, this is Madonna. Hey Madonna. Hey Madonna. Oh chicky 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 chicky. Oh chicky 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 chicky. Some of these ones I used to hold like this. Um, on my hand for the longest time even before I started vlogging again but they're really nice chickens chicken chicken did you lay this giant rock what the heckums at least they don't peck me Good girl, Madonna. Daisy. All right, now that they're in the pasture, I'm just curious to see how much pressure it takes for them to run. So this might have been a bad idea. Like I might not ever catch them again without some kind of a trap or if they go back inside of there. I thought that keeping them in the barn for like a month or so or however long that was would have been like beneficial like they would have trusted me like I am their shepherd but it's okay the, the more wild the better I think big farm is huge right now he probably broke 24 inches uh, little peas over 16 inches this this here just needs to be the ram pen until I <clears throat> fence off another pen big enough for just males and then I'll choose which male and to breed all the females or which males to breed all the females uh, this next season probably in a couple months I'll let him loose let one of the males loose so that he could breed them all or work them for a couple months and then I'll bring him back in to the sheep or the ram barn or ram pen. I might do like the ram pen over in that corner where that feeder is or here. This is like two or three options I was gonna do. This barn needs to be two to three times bigger. I need to have it more enclosed. Um, I need to have like, see this side is open here. Well, let's say I have like uh, another section here all walled off and then a sliding door. That way this thing is completely covered from wind and the cold. And I can put insulation on the walls or whatnot. Um, I think that'll be a good idea. Cause it's really sad when lambs die. Uncle Ben, he's so nice. He checked up on me. He's like, how are the babies doing? And I said, well, another one died. And he's like, it's tough. I know, and he's like, you need a, a lamb barn. And I really do, it's just money is the issue. Well, look at that. This is the ending of the video. They are going back. <laughs> I sent a, a fax to them, said, go back home. Forgot to say one more thing. Ah! Hey, that's Very Uncle good. Ben. Very good, sir. Very good. <laughs>